In the extremely unlikely event of a pandemic, you will be asked to stay at home. Don't worry, a cure will be found in a matter of days. We've prepared this simple guide to ease you and your family into this new world. Viruses are occasionally spread through contact with others. So keep handshakes brief, and one kiss on the cheek will do. Limit contact with those that aren't your immediate family, neighbors, friends, co-workers, associates, shopkeepers, or fancy women. You're much safer at home where the virus can't get you. Leave any unnecessary outdoor activity to mother. Food may become scarce, but fortunately, all those tubby moggies can be cooked up by mother into a delicious stew. Do remember, the virus is in all food. So give it a rinse under the tap first. The government will supply each household with a weekly ration of lard. Don't fear, Mother. There'll be some left over for you. The virus cannot attach itself to skin. Hand washing is a myth spread by communists. But listen here, Mother. Cleanliness is next to godliness. So don't slack just because the world is ending. A minimum of 14 hours a day should be spent by the woman of the house cleaning inside and out. Make sure you clean the road thoroughly after each use. All schools will be closed immediately. In addition to cleaning, mother should spend 10 hours a day homeschooling her brood. If father isn't too busy, he could perhaps chip in and help mother with some of those difficult questions. After all, what does mother know? It's expected that after some time, children will become feral and form gangs that roam the streets at night, killing small animals. If a good hiding doesn't do the job to get them back on the straight and narrow, then leave it to the virus to sort them out. Hopefully you're now feeling well prepared to deal with a pandemic. Chin up, it'll never happen. <laughs>